P is stored in the balls. All right, guys, welcome back to another part of GTA San Andreas, the definitive edition. Now, I just realized something to do with the map. This wasn't present in GTA 3 or Vice City. Now, as we travel more the map, it actually becomes a bit lighter. So as you can see, how big is it? Oh my god damn! This map is huge! Holy shoot! So literally, like, this whole section here, say from here to... Well, this whole portion of the island, ignore this little part here. So I'd say from here all the way across to the right. That's about the size of GTA 3 and GTA, GTA Vice City put together, probably. So this map is huge. Jesus! God damn, I didn't realise that. But yeah, as we travel through more of the map, it does appear to sort of lighten up the map so we can actually see where we've travelled and where we haven't. Actually quite a neat feature. Now, I'm not sure why they didn't put it across the whole trilogy. Maybe it was a San Andreas only feature, because I can't remember this feature being in GTA 5 either. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but anyway, you guys are awesome. Let's get it! Who's dialing up me, bitch? Carl, it's Officer Hernandez. Who? Officer Hernandez. I work with Tenpenny and Pulaski. Oh, Hello. the bitch! Hello. What the hell you want? Hey, show me some respect, boy. Go fuck yourself. You just stay, bitch. You watch your tone, boy. Now listen, I've got a message from Officer Tenpenny. Don't try and leave town. That would be a big mistake. You hear me? We're watching you. Whatever you say, oh, bitch. I agree. He is a bitch. Hey, you gotta keep it real, man. Man, nobody give a shit about the hood. I do. All they do is sell yay and ruin the place. No crack ever made a gang type. Oh, no, man. What's up, y'all? What's up, CJ? What's crack? Man, all they care about is smoking and money. You can't knock a homie's hustle, sweet. And Mark ain't soldiers. They idiots trying to be businessmen. Yeah, but they down with us, man. All they down with is money. CJ, go down there and show these fools you mean business. These chumps from the balls are sweating the homies. Go put pressure on them. Let's do it. We've been putting time in the hood, but we got to get the homies back together. Like the old days. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, you right. So you and Ryder gonna handle your business. Man, they're slang to their own mama. They don't care about nothing. You're naive, my friend. We gotta keep our focus. We need some backup. You seen beat up? Nah. But him and the homeboy Bear, they good to have on our side. Oh, Big Bear? Yeah, them bass slangers gonna be sorry now. Hey, beat up is only a couple of blocks away. Your hood's all messed up, huh? Yeah, you try to get any of these crackheads to help you out. No one of the families ain't up on it. Apart from Smoke, Sweet, and you know yours truly, Grove Street don't bang no more. Okay, so what we actually got in the previous part, which is actually kind of sweet, is we we got yeah, the police on us. Blown. Hang on. For sure. So we got the police on us because we were doing a tutorial for spray painting the tags to gain respect and the basic scene is collectibles so what we were doing is we are doing that and the cops went on us and I killed both of the cops and got their weapons so now we have weapons we shouldn't have. Hey slow down fool, you don't even know which door it is. Whatever man, this it? Yeah, this it right here. Open up! You sure he still live here? Fool, I told you this it. Open up! Who the fuck is it? CJ, the fuck you want? Get the fuck out of here. Wait, hold up, man. What happened to for life, nigga? The only thing that matters is the hood, homie. But you'll never understand what getting this money is like. You know what, man? Get the fuck out of here before you be laying on your back. Big Bear, come check this fool. Hey, Bear? <coughs> Big Bear, that's you? Hey, you still from the hood, homie, or nah, what? the only thing Bear give a fuck about is smoking and keeping my house clean. Ain't that right, Big Bear? <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah what? Hell yeah, sir. Now go make that motherfucking toilet spark. Oh, no, man. Oh, man. Bear, come on. Everyone likes to party sometimes, CJ. I'll see you around. Stay the fuck from around here, punk. Hey, nigga, fuck you. Damn. This shit's fucked up. 
I see what you mean now, man. If Crack can do that to Big Bear, turn him into a base slave, the average motherfucker ain't got a chance. Damn dope fiends and drug addicts everywhere in the city. Piss me off. Look like it's up to us, then. Let's just cruise through the hood and find us somebody selling. Go beat up the crack dealer. Here we go. First taste of combat. So what I actually like is San Andreas started introducing long cutscenes rather than cutscenes that were about 20 seconds long in GTA 3. So we're actually getting proper cutscenes, not GTA 5 level, of course, because, you know, we're talking about PS2 era. But um, we're getting better hey, cutscenes. Somebody's selling one of the homies. Hello, motherfucker. Hey, partner, oh, I'm working. Fish! Is he dead? I think he is. He's gotta be. Man, I know this cat. He a punk used to run with a front yard baller OG from Idlewood. I know his place. It's just across the tracks there. Let's check it out. Hey, ain't that front yard turf? Man, are you a buster? Nah, I'm down, homie. Hey, grab hold of that bat over there. Uh, okay, so I can swap weapons for a nightstick. I'm gonna have to anyway, aren't I? Well, actually, shit, I didn't need to. Oh, well. Man, on a serious mission now. Man, don't sweat it, homie. Everybody in the hood know ballers are pussies. You know what? I'm just gonna use my shotty. I could easily get away just using the baseball bat, but why not use the shotgun? Just to make the mission a bit quicker anyway. Okay. Here we come. Open up, fuck face. Ooh, wee. Man, you can smell a crack den a mile away. Yeah, let's shoot through and introduce ourselves. Let's go, boy. Crack then. I like how it literally says Good the location. Crack then. The dope pushers. Grove Street OGs come to do damage. Oh, someone was getting a blowy then. Fuck them Grove Street fools. Grove Don't Street going down. Oh, what? Oh. oh. I don't give a shit. How are they still? Put a cap in your ass. You are not quicker than a gun, my friend. Wait, is that it done? Okay, he's just out of his mind there. Can we, can we shoot him? You should have stayed at home. Yep, let's just get him. You know what? Let's just put everyone down. Hang on, where did the bitch go? Get out my face! Hey, you need a hole put in you, huh? Just to be safe. You marks. Sorry. Oh, take out the trash. Come on, guys. Really? Right, let's just go, because we got one star as well. I do not want to get two or more stars. Now ballers know Grove Street families on their way back up. Um, we haven't got a vehicle. Hang on, I will take this. Thank you very much. Oh, what happened to that? Oh, shit. Always forget the police are dressed differently in this. Hang on. And now we got two stars. Oh man, they gonna be mad at us. And I warn the game later. For now, this is bass in the silence of victory, motherfucker. Oh. Oh. Now that the base ain't getting pushed up in their faces, maybe these fools should be up for some real banging. Yeah, Grove gonna get back on his feet now for sure though. Later, homie. Ooh, okay, so we've got a police bike already. That might come in handy, so uh, hang on. What I'm gonna do, save it in here. Here we go. Thank you. So I don't know if when we save a vehicle, if we have like, you know, a selection to choose from, or if the garage literally just opens up and whatever vehicle's there, it just stays like that. So I don't think it permanently stores it, but I need to get more pistol ammo ideally. I haven't got that much, but we haven't got the option to buy guns yet. Should get it now, actually, because the mission's called drive through. Riding? Respect has to be earned, sweet, just like money. So what you saying? You don't respect me? What I'm saying is, speak up, nigga. I'm hungry. Oh, man, <laughs> shit. Hey, man what's going cannot on? live on bread alone. I know. I tried that shit. Carl, you look a little thin, man. You gotta be hungry, man. Yeah, man, I what could What you eat. fools trying to eat? That's what about some tacos? Tacos again? Hell no. Chicken, man. No discussion. Man, I don't want no chicken. Carl, you dry. Smoke looks like he gonna pass out. Okay, I remember this mission purely because there's an iconic, well, not an iconic I'm line. There's a bunch of iconic we lines. We all gotta talk about it. They was going for sweet. How you supposed to know that? You know what people are like. 
Say they have love for you, but won't say a word. Too damn scared. Some people say they saw a green saber doing the work, then speeding away. Yeah, but people like to talk, don't they? Anyway, that's half of Santos you talking about. Jill, yeah, you right. My bad. Hey, bruh. They have sprayed the house. Yeah, hey, I ain't see shit. Okay, so whenever I'm near a mission marker here, I'm just going to let them continue speaking and then go into the marker. Just so we don't miss out on any important dialogue, potentially. Can I take your order, please? Carl, what do you want? You gotta eat to keep your strength up, man. Hey, I'll take a number nine, fat boy. Give me a number nine, just like he is. Uh, let me get a number six with extra dip. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra dip, a number seven, two number 45s, one with cheese, and a large soap. Hey, sorry, bro. You know I gotta know about mine. I know, CJ, I know. I'm just trying not to think about it, so. I mean, I didn't even know she was hit until it was all over. Yeah, right, 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 right. Let's eat. Hey, don't we got beef around here? We've been getting into it with these fools. I can't stand cold food. Unlike you, I ain't never ate from a trash can. <laughs> oh, shit. Trash can, bitch. Pass me my food. Hey, hey, look. Kilo Trey scoping us out. Damn, Ryder, you are jinx. Shit, the motherfuckers headed to the hood. Drive by! Let's roll! Oh, Get shit. Oh, they're gonna die. There we go. Boom, baby. Okay, let's get these guns. Just come to be safe. On, oh, oh, fuck! Okay, so what have we got now? So we got the pistol, the Tech 9, and we've got a shotgun. So we are doing alright for weapons at the moment, considering we shouldn't even be using firearms yet. Hang on, who's shooting at us? CJ, what you doing? Damn, that was some serious shit. Yeah, man, those ball fools won't try that again. Carl, let's get back to the grove. Alright, I'm on it. Oh, man. That fool filled a hole. You chubby motherfucker. Next time you better start blast or I'ma blast you myself. Smoke you wide, man. I mean wide. <laughs> and that's why you love me, baby. That's one up for the grow. Say what, Smoke? All you managed to do was eat my damn food up. Yeah, it was getting cold. Y'all coming in for a beer? Nah, baby. I need to get back to the crib. CJ, give me a ride. All right, Smoke, let's go. See y'all later. How the hell did he eat all that food? What was with you back there, Smoke? Man, if you can eat your food while everybody else is losing theirs and blaming you, you straight, huh? What? Nothing. Nothing. Just some poetry, I mean. Hey, Smoke, tell me why you moved out the grove. Man, got some money from my aunt. I mean, it's a nice place and all, but the grove is in my heart, baby. It's where my dogs is at. Yeah, okay, homie. Hey, thanks, Carl. Hey, I miss having you around, baby. Thanks, man. I wish Sweet thought like that. He don't mean it, CJ. He's still real tore up about your moms, man. Here, get yourself a little smoky smoke on smoke and relax, homie. Okay, we really haven't got that much money, but you know what? I know we've already sprayed over these, okay? So yeah, we really haven't got that much money, but... That is probably one of the only missions I remember in that game. It's uh, quite iconic now. Wait, hang on, if I check the map, what the hell is that trophy thing there? So let's go to press R1 for key. The trophy is... Okay, so we can race and then we've already got two properties, three. 
yeah, free properties available to buy. Uh, we can get tattooed. We can go to Cluck and Bell. So already there's more to do in this game than there was in the end game of Vice City, which is crazy to think. I don't know. I don't know if they were maybe doing this game and spending the most amount of time on it. And then GTA 3 and GTA Vice City was sort of done by other departments of Rockstar. Because you have got, I think it's about 12 or 13 studios or something like that. Something like that, yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Hey, CJ, it's sweet. Hey, what's up? If you don't respect your body, ain't nobody gonna respect you. You're too skinny, CJ. You need to pack on some muscle. If I wanted nagging, I'd buy a clockwork wife. Just look it out for you, homie. It's all show and respect, you know. <laughs> yeah, I guess. This is Jim I go to a couple blocks out from the Grove. Go check it out and get yourself a gangster physique. I'll scope it out. <laughs> Later, man. Yeah, baby! So if you want muscle to increase stamina or muscle, well, if you want to increase stamina or muscle, or learn new moves, you need to go to the gym, go to the dumbbell icon displayed on the radar, and check out the gym. You know what? We'll actually go ahead and do that now, because CJ is looking skinny. He's got the same bodybuild as me, so let's actually go there, build some muscle. I was going to do another mission, but we might as well go there, get him to build some muscle, see what he can learn. But I know it's limited to how much you can do per day, so I think you have to wait... I don't know if you have to wait 24 hours or how long you have to actually wait, but you can only do a certain amount in a specific game day. So let's actually go there and get weightlifting, baby. Should I uh, probably put the gun away? No pain, no gain. There we go. So there's the boxing or uh, stamina. You know what? Let's uh, let's lift some weights. Uh, go with go for 20 pounds. Why not? Here we go. So, to lift the dumbbell, press X when the energy bar is inside the highlighted zone. This will increase your muscle, so... I'm gonna beat you <laughs> yeah, buddy! Lightweight! There we go. You gotta follow okay, so it goes quicker. So, yeah, it goes quicker, but the, the actual area that we can tap X in gets larger as well. Okay, so body muscle is already upgraded. We're getting those gains! Come on, baby! <laughs> Lightweight! Yeah, buddy! For anyone that doesn't know, and there's that uncultured, it's Ronnie Coleman, who is an absolute fucking icon. Yeah, buddy! Lightweight! Come on, I'm coming. I'm coming in front of thousands and thousands of people. I'm coming day and night. It's fantastic. Come on. Cheat on girls, not curls. Maybe I need to choose... Hang on, is that still upgrading me muscle? I think it is. Maybe we should have changed the weight. I think we should have. Body muscle. Okay, so I don't know if it is just limiting us to how much we can do, because we've done 32 reps already. Let's just try and get genetically jacked and athletically stacked to make sure CJ looks like a fucking cyborg. Let's go, baby. I don't know how much muscle we need to get to be able to see a proper difference, because at the moment in time, I can't see that much of a difference. We should... Ah, damn it. You've reached your limit for today. Come back tomorrow. Are you kidding me? Uh, he hasn't really changed, has he? Nah, he hasn't really changed. Oh, no. Oh, wait there. I could have used other machines. So I think that's maybe... Maybe we've hit our limit for weightlifting and not the other machines. So let's actually... Let's try this one out. Oh, you've worked out enough for today. Come back tomorrow. Can they really not use any others? Don't do this to me. Watch what I'm doing. Sorry. Let's see who wins. Why's he got glasses on? <laughs> Watch your Dude. Opponent. No, Dude, your why he got glasses on for boxing? Okay. I think it will knock me back for this as well, but let's just try it. Yo, you want to learn Watch some new moves? Oh, yeah. Man, Go ahead. You're an Get yourself some muscles first. You know what? That was nice. Keep your fists up and together. Gonna teach you some respect, kid. Crotch stomp. You had enough, mate. You had enough. Who needs some muscles? Who needs some muscles? I may need some muscles, but you need a pulse. How's about that, kid? Are you done? Are you done? Beat you silly. Who's gonna beat me silly? Come on, I'll go for you as well. Come on, come on. Come on, that's wearing that stupid hat. Ish, 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 ish. 
You know what? You want to disrespect me. I've just took out a membership in this place. I've just took out a membership and you want to disrespect me in this gym. Really? Any of you fools want it? Any Anyone? How you this asshole? You want me to shoot you as well? You know what? I was going to let you live. But you're wearing sunglasses indoor. So, uh, sorry. Maybe that was a bit overboard. Oh well, I'll be back tomorrow. If there is a gym tomorrow. <laughs>